Hi, I'm Susie London, and I am the playwright of The Gigi Pick. I'm a person who has sort of two career lines going. I'm an, a writer, an actress, and a singer, but I'm also a holistic doctor, and I frequently read medical abstracts, and I read this medical abstract about this woman who had an implant in her brain to prevent uh, her epileptic attacks. And whenever I hear about somebody having an issue, I thought, oh, I wonder if what I do would help that. There's nothing that's really going to help her now, but I I really thought it was a story that needed to be told. To see this, this idea, which I had late last year, 2023, is when it first struck me, I really, I really want to tell this this story. It is based on actual events, and it's kind of unbelievable. You go, no, wait, this didn't really happen. Oh, yeah, it did. One thing that has happened is people that have stepped in for rehearsals or people working on it have said to me, I had no idea. I had no idea this was going on. I had no idea it was even possible. And that made me feel really good that I was maybe bringing something forth. Hey, people, we need to be aware of certain things. I mean, I, I've read many, many articles. I did a lot of research, 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 research uh, on it. And um, we don't know why these things go awry, especially if it's not programmed in. Where does that, where's that coming from? So it's a good idea to be aware because this is happening in our world now. This is a very big part of what's going on. And we need to know that so that we make intelligent decisions. And what you'll see in the Gigi pick is these things do have influence. And is that influence healthy? The playwriting unit, it's a very good opportunity for anybody who wants to write to hone their piece because there's a lot of experienced people in that playwriting unit. And anybody, any actor or person who thinks they want to uh, write would be wise to join the theater and become a part of that workshop. It's a fantastic opportunity.